Hello, it's nice hey. to see you two. Thank you for being here. Thank you for having us. So we're wondering, we need to know, tell us, who is the Grafenberg Disciples? Grafenberg Disciples is a group of goofball musicians. We just get together and have fun and write music. You have this new song out. What is the inspiration behind this song? The song is written about Neil Peart from Rush. Neil died January 7th of 2020. A lot of people know him as the drummer for Rush, but he was also their lyricist. He was a philosopher, a historian, an author, and an avid motorcyclist. He wrote all these books about it. And when he left us, I was left with an overwhelming sense of there was no words to describe this loss. There were no words to describe what he meant to such a broad cross-section of this world. That there would be no more words from this man. A man who made his living and lived his life in the pursuit of words. So that's where the, the song No Words came from. So tell us about this video. Well, the video is the Grafenberg Disciples way of paying homage to a man that affected us in a lot of different ways and affected a lot of people throughout the world. But we want to do this in a very respectful way. What I don't want to do is look at this as some opportunistic thing. This is not. This is us talking about somebody that meant a lot to us for a lot of different reasons. So what we have done is we have partnered with Neil's preferred charity, the Cedar sinai Special Research Program into Glioblastoma, which is the disease that unfortunately took him from us. Um, so all the proceeds from this song and this video will go directly to that charity. And at the end of the video, there actually is a link. And if they are so moved, they can make a direct donation. The drummer on this song, actually the whole album, is a fellow by the name of Greg Bissonette, okay? He has the dubious distinction of being Neil Peart's teacher at one point. When Neil wanted to learn about playing swing jazz, he went to Greg, because Greg is a known expert in that, and got lessons from, from Greg. So when Greg came in to play on this track, there's actually some parts of Neil playing on the track. And when Greg had just done his tracks, and he was listening to it. And he looked up, and his eyes were all red and kind of tearing up. And I said, Greg, what's wrong? And he said, I can't believe I'm playing with Neil again. 